our beloved Nelson Holisasa Mandela, the founding president of our democratic nation, has departed. These were the words that South Africans had feared for months as Nelson Mandela battled with a long-standing lung infection. But the news came that he had passed away, age 95, at his family home in Johannesburg. I'm sad, but at the same time, I think he's, he's had his part in life and he did it very well. And it's fine that he goes. He did all he could. He was old, you know? Yeah. You know, it's, it's tragic, it's sad. But at the same time, I think we should celebrate, celebrate what he has achieved and what he's given us. We wouldn't be, uh, I wouldn't be free, let's just say, if it wasn't for him. The announcement came overnight, and many mourners poured onto the streets outside his house to pay tribute to their hero wearing just their pajamas. Freedom fighter, prisoner, statesman, and Nobel Peace Prize winner, his life was the stuff of legend, and many considered him family. I'm really going to miss Mandela because it's like a father to me. He's also a role model like Martin Luther, a great fighter and a strong man. And I think it's a very sad time, but also a time of a possible renaissance or a rebirth and, um, and an incredible opportunity. And like I said, um, an opportunity to, to celebrate 95 years. As preparations are underway for what some are calling the largest state funeral since Winston Churchill's, South Africans united in song to bid farewell to Madiba.